It seems like the more paint jobs that go through your shop, the more work you make for yourself with all the necessary cleanup. This kind of mess is a real hassle, but it's been an unavoidable part of the job. Until now, the 3M paint preparation system offers a simple solution to this time-consuming mess. The heart of the system is the 3M PPS mixing cup, which is used with this flexible, disposable liner. Here's how it works. First, remove the existing spray gun cup. An adapter that's correct for the spray gun you're using is then threaded on securely. Choose either a large or small 3M PPS mixing cup, whichever best suits the size of your paint job. Take a matching liner from the convenient dispenser and place it in the mixing cup. You're now set to measure your paint right in the cup, either on a scale or with a paint manufacturer's measuring stick. The 3M paint preparation system also provides you with another option. The 3M mix ratio film has graduated markings that can be used to measure the paint. It can be inserted to read from either inside or outside and is placed in the mixing cup. The liner is inserted and you can now measure the paint from the side you chose. Mixing the primer, sealer, base coat or clear coat for conventional or water-based paint is done in the normal way in accordance with the paint manufacturer's guidelines. The paint can be weighed and thinned as usual. Lids are also provided in a convenient wall-mounted dispenser. Each lid is provided with a built-in paint strainer and snaps easily onto the liner. A locking collar secures the assembly. If the paint needs to be shaken, the 3M PPS shaker core is used to protect the mixing cup while it's clamped in the shaker. The lid can be sealed with a cap, or if the paint is going to be used immediately, the mixing cup is fitted to your spray gun. With the mixing cup upright, the gun is inverted to fit over the lid and locked in place with a simple half turn making sure that the lid fingers fully engage the adapter. Keeping the mixing cup upright, attach an air hose and carefully pull the trigger to bleed air from the liner. The liner collapses until only paint is being delivered to the spray gun nozzle. This feature offers you terrific productivity because now you can spray with a gun held in any orientation. Difficult angles, even spraying upside down, is a snap. Your spray gun is now a closed system, and the liner continues to collapse as you use up the paint. When you've finished painting, disconnect the airline, invert the gun, and open the trigger all the way for a few seconds. This releases the vacuum, allowing paint in the gun to drain back into the cup. With the gun disconnected from the cup, the lid and collapsed liner can be removed and discarded. Always remember to follow local and state regulations for proper disposal or storage of refinished materials. If there's paint left over that you want to keep, the liner can be sealed with a cap and saved for future use. Consult the MSDS and your local regulations for proper labeling and storage. The only equipment you have to clean is the gun. A quick wash and you're done with everything neat and ready for your next job. The 3M paint preparation system is efficient. It uses just one cup for measuring, mixing, and spraying. And the built-in strainer allows the gun to run cleaner with less waste and mess. It's effective. It's a closed system. That means less outside contamination for cleaner jobs. And a closed system can deliver paint uniformly to the spray nozzle, allowing you to do excellent work at any angle and it's economical. Mixed colors can be stored for later use. There's up to a 70% savings on cleaning solvent with a reduction in hazardous waste. But most of all, you'll see an immediate savings in valuable labor that's currently being spent on cleanup. Labor time that can now be used to increase your productivity and profitability. Efficient, effective, economical. It's a small investment that pays big dividends. The 3M Paint Preparation System.
Stay tuned for paint preparation tips. If the threaded insert does not properly fit the paint gun, check to see if the two-piece insert may have been removed with the gun cup. If you use the mix ratio film insert facing in, the measuring process is much like using a metal mix stick. You look down into the cup to check the measurement as the ingredients are poured. This may sound simple, but make sure the liner is in the cup before you pour. To check that the lid and liner are engaged, hold the lid fingers and give them a few quick spins. If both the lid and liner turn, they are properly engaged. Here are three good ways to tint. One, Disconnect the gun from the cup, pop the lid, and add your tint. Two, for mixing color in the cup, attach the lid to the gun, add some two inch masking tape to the top of the liner, pour some of the mix into the lid, do a spray test, and retint as needed. Three, place the cup on the table, spin off the locking ring, Remove gun with ring and lid attached and set it aside. Now you're ready for tinting. If you need to add reducer to blend, put the blending agent in a squeeze bottle. Turn the bottle at an angle, insert it into the PPS cup spout and add the reducer. If you need to refill the cup, place the cup on the table Spin the locking ring off, remove gun with locking ring and lid, and you're ready to refill. Always remember to follow local and state regulations for proper disposal or storage of refinished materials. You can clean the PPS locking ring and cup with solvent, but don't soak them in the solvent. This may not happen every time, but if you have a small amount of material left in the gun, invert the gun, disconnect the line, pull the trigger full on for a count of three to let a small amount of air back into the liner, reattach the line, and turn the gun upright. You are now able to use the remainder of the material in the cup. 3M. A century of innovation.